how are things looking this evening? I'm channeling a magician at the moment. The number of the day, uh, 2021. And in fact, it is a year. It's four years away, you'll notice. Uh, but unfortunately, this is when the beleaguered state airline SAA will need loans and guarantees from government bailouts until 2021. That was revealed by SAA CEO Vujani Jirana in Parliament today. The airline's annual report and financial statements were being scrutinized by MPs. Now this uh, number year is a stark reminder that although government says it is committed to stabilizing state-owned entities that have been plagued by financial battles and claims of inefficiency, uh, sometimes even worse mismanagement and corruption, it could be a while before some of them stand on their own two feet. Certainly SAA, it remains heavily indebted. It's always claimed it was never fully capitalized by government or given enough money to be in a position where it can compete and grow without struggling. Joanna says the airline is battling to meet its financial obligations to keep flying at the moment. And then he reminded uh, South Africa and Parliament that it's been accumulating debt since 2012. Of course, there has been talk of allowing private partners to inject money into SAA and help it become more efficient and then benefit from the profits. But it's unclear if the new administration other, under Cyril Ramaphosa, uh, the president, will go that route. Well, let's look at some of the scenes from Parliament today. Manelise Dubase has more.